Nigerian notorious kidnapper Evans, whose real name is Chuku Dubem Onwo Amadike, has been sentenced to death after being tried for more than four years for kidnapping and other notorious activities in Nigeria. He was sentenced to death by a federal high court in Lagos after he was found guilty of kidnapping and possession of firearms. Chuku Dubem Onwo Amadike, who is popularly known as Evans, made waves years ago after he was arrested for kidnapping. His oppression was uncovered and he was found guilty of countless kidnapping. Evans is one of the biggest criminals in Nigeria. When he was arrested, the authorities uncovered all the fortune the man has gathered with his illegal and criminal acts. Evans made over 6 billion naira from kidnapping and was regarded as one of Nigeria's leading billionaire. But after his arrest in 2017, his properties, cars, houses and assets worth over billions of naira was seized by the Nigerian federal government. He was then charged to court and his case has remained in court since 2017 to date. When the federal high court in Lagos finalized his case, he was found guilty of all the charges leveled against him and was sentenced to death. Evans was arrested in 2017 after the kidnap of one chief Donatus Duru, a billionaire businessman from the eastern part of Nigeria. Evans collected a whooping sum of $600,000 and still never released the victim. In addition, he confessed that he was guilty for most high-profile kidnap in Nigeria. Uh, when we get there, uh, we we'll, we'll carry the man and put inside motor and go. No, it's not inside the house. It's maybe around the road. Mm. Mm. So you wait for your victims to come out? Yes. It's okay, the there. highest money we collected is from First Act, $1 million. From somebody living in First Act. It's just because uh, maybe they are wasting time. You understand? Mm. Because when they are wasting time, you have to wait for the money to be complete. They have people that will be feeding them over there. They have some people there that will be feeding them. How many high that? Just one. Where? Where? It's around the Egonde area. Because he rent, he rented apartment or he built the place? Rented apartment. Okay. The name of the boys is uh, Uche. Mm -hmm. And uh, um, hey. How many of them? Just there are two. Okay, just two. Are they yeah. armed? I can't remember his name. You say you can't remember the second person? Are they armed? Person? No. I know the boy. I know the boy called... Um, he's an Igbo boy. From mm. where? He's from Agri. Agri. Yes. Agri. His name is escaped me, but I'll remember. Okay. Mm. When he was arrested and charged to court, Investigations revealed that he had a wife and children that were living fine and large. Unfortunately, his wife and children has gone back to poverty after all his properties worth billions of naira was seized by the Nigerian federal government. Well, it looks like Evans has finally met his water law. The federal high court in Lagos sentenced him to death on Thursday. The billionaire has finally gotten a verdict for all his crimes in Nigeria and I believe this will serve as a lesson for those planning to go into kidnapping and other forms of criminal activities. Who and who fired gun in that operation? You know I was driving. Yeah, I yeah, know. You understand now? Who and who carried the gun? Who carried the gun? Okay, so Ushi and the uh, Anchman and uh, Nandi. How did you sustain this letter? Wait a minute, I'm not doing drug business. You say what? It's when I'm doing drug business in South Africa. That is where I got the bedroom. How? Uh. Somebody shot me. 
How many countries have you loved? Only South Africa and like Ghana. When you get your uh, ransom from here, where do you spend it? On how do you spend it? I spend it here in Nigeria. I have not traveled since 2007. How do you feel that your children will be seeing something like this? I don't have any message for them. God will take control. I'm, I'm advising that anybody that's anybody that's doing kidnapping should quit. Chukwude Ono Amadeke, popularly known as Evans, is a Nigerian notorious kidnapper. He is a native of Newi, a small town in Anambra State in the southeastern part of Nigeria. He is sometimes referred to as the billionaire kidnapper because the Nigerian police force believes he is one of the richest criminals in the kidnapping business in Nigeria. He has made over 9 billion in kidnapping. In some of his operations, he made amount up to $1 million in one single kidnapping. The Inspector General of Police Special Intelligence Response Team of the Nigerian Police Force also described him as a very smart, crafty and intelligent kidnapper, having escaped arrest for more than four years even though he was on the most wanted list in three states, namely Lagos State, Edo State and Anambra State. Evans was arrested in Lagos on 11 June 2017 and was reprimanded in prison for more than four years and waiting trial. Evans undergone a 52 count charges of multiple murders, armed robberies, kidnapping, unlawful possessions of firearms, unlawful possession of ammunition, conspiracy, among other charges. Specifically, he's been charged of unlawful capture of Uche Okerafo in Festac area of Lagos State on 21st November 2017 and demanded a ransom of $2 million. According to the Director of Public Prosecution, Mrs. Titilayo Shiti B, Evans contravenes Section 409 and Section 269 of the Criminal Laws of Lagos State 2011. Unfortunately, his end came on Thursday after he was found guilty of all the 52 count charges of multiple murders, armed robberies, kidnappings, unlawful possession of firearms, unlawful possession of ammunition, conspiracy, and other criminal acts, and he was finally sentenced to death by hanging.